Hi all, my name is Mass Barnkop from Casa Power Electronics. In this video I have recorded some high speed photography of this Tesla coil. It is a quasi resonant solid state Tesla coil which means it runs with very long on times that is synced to the mains sine wave envelope. So I recorded this in 8000 fps which is 8000 frames per second which makes the single frame get down to 125 microseconds. So that gives a great detail on the spark growth, but still spark growth is so fast that even that speed is really not enough to get it all in detail. We would need to get up in millions of frames per second, but then we have another problem and that is getting enough light into the camera and also maintain a good enough focus um, depth. So I hope you enjoyed these um, recordings and I have especially two features that I would like you to look out for. The first thing I want you to notice in these high-speed recordings is how the spark grows. Here we can see that I have picked up six frames from the recordings and it is one frame, the second frame, the sixth frame and then there's 20 frames apart from the three last pictures. So what we can see here is there is a instantly very long very sharp flash of a spark that's very straight and then it diminishes as we can see in the third frame here and then it starts to crinkle and wrinkle as it starts to get more and more energy fed into the spark channel but it is really interesting to see how fast the first step leader actually grows and it is very long and unfortunately it's not possible to see exactly how long it is here as the point at the maximum length uh, is drawn back very quickly but we can see as the spark channel grows that it gets back to that um, initial length again. The second interesting thing I found in these recordings is what I would call uh, collapsing spark channels that results in over voltage or overheating of some other parts of the channel. So here I marked up five frames and in the first frame to the left I put in three yellow squares where I want you to notice how these wrinkles of the spark uh, disappears by simply being bridged over by a shorter path. But as this results in a clearly some kind of plasma ball or at least some very uh, hot spot in the plasma channel that is formed on the branch on the way down. So you could imagine that all the energy that is now being put into the spark but then the spark load suddenly gets yeah, put in half that the energy being pumped into that load is suddenly the yeah, double amount to the space and some kind of hotspot appears. That, that's at least a theory just from looking some of these recordings because it does not appear all the time. But nonetheless a pretty interesting feature in these recordings. Thank you. 